Building codes play a pivotal role in ensuring the safety and resilience of structures in earthquake-prone regions. These codes are designed to provide guidelines for construction, ensuring that buildings can withstand seismic forces and minimize the risk of damage or collapse during an earthquake. We will explore the importance of building codes in earthquake-prone regions through case studies from different parts of the world. The Loma Prieta Earthquake and the Evolution of Building Codes in California The Loma Prieta Earthquake in 1989, centered in the San Francisco Bay Area, was a significant event that shaped building codes in California. The earthquake caused widespread damage, including the collapse of the Cypress Street Viaduct in Oakland, highlighting the need for stronger seismic regulations. Following the earthquake, California updated its building codes, introducing stricter seismic standards. These new codes required retrofitting of older buildings and improved construction practices to enhance earthquake resilience. The Christchurch Earthquake and New Zealand's Resilience Efforts In 2010 and 2011, a series of devastating earthquakes struck Christchurch, New Zealand. The destruction caused by these earthquakes prompted New Zealand to re-evaluate and strengthen its building codes. The country introduced the Building Act 2004, which included more stringent seismic provisions, mandatory seismic assessments, and earthquake-prone building identification. These measures aim to enhance the resilience of buildings and infrastructure in the face of future earthquakes. The Lessons from the Great East Japan Earthquake the Great East Japan Earthquake and Tsunami of 2011 was one of the most powerful earthquakes in recorded history. Japan's strict building codes and advanced engineering practices were put to the test, and the results were remarkable. Most modern buildings and infrastructure withstood the shaking, minimizing casualties. The earthquake highlighted the importance of robust building codes, innovative engineering, and public awareness in earthquake-prone regions. Earthquake Resilient Construction in Nepal Nepal, nestled in the Himalayas, is highly susceptible to seismic activity. The devastating earthquake of 2015, with its epicenter in Gorkha, brought attention to the need for better building codes and construction practices. In response, Nepal adopted the National Building Code of Nepal in 2015, which emphasizes earthquake-resistant construction techniques and materials. NGOs and international organizations have also supported earthquake-resilient reconstruction efforts in the country. Retrofitting Historic Buildings in Istanbul Istanbul, Turkey, sits on a seismically active region known as the North Anatolian Fault. The city is home to numerous historic buildings, making earthquake resilience a significant challenge. In recent years, Istanbul has initiated a comprehensive retrofitting program to strengthen its older structures while preserving their cultural heritage. Building codes have been adapted to accommodate these retrofitting efforts, ensuring the city's resilience in the face of seismic threats. Innovations in Seismic Engineering Advancements in seismic engineering have played a pivotal role in improving earthquake resilience. These innovations include base isolators, which allow buildings to move independently from ground motion and dampers that absorb seismic energy. The incorporation of these technologies into building codes has increased the capacity of structures to withstand earthquakes. The Role of Public Awareness and Education Building codes alone cannot guarantee earthquake resilience. Public awareness and education are vital components of any seismic resilience strategy. Communities in earthquake-prone regions must be educated about the risks and preparedness measures. Building codes often include provisions for mandatory earthquake drills and the dissemination of earthquake safety information to the public. Ongoing Challenges and Future Developments While significant progress has been made in earthquake-prone regions to improve building codes and seismic resilience, challenges persist. One challenge is the retrofitting of existing buildings. Many older structures do not meet current seismic standards and require costly upgrades to become earthquake-resistant. This process often involves striking a balance between preserving historical architecture and enhancing safety. Moreover, monitoring and enforcement of building codes are essential. Regular inspections and adherence to seismic regulations ensure that new constructions meet the required standards. In the future, advancements in technology, such as real-time structural health monitoring systems, may help assess the condition of buildings during and after an earthquake. These systems can provide valuable data to improve building codes and enhance emergency response efforts. 
Additionally, research into earthquake prediction and early warning systems continues to progress. While we cannot predict earthquakes with pinpoint accuracy, early warning systems can provide seconds to minutes of advance notice, allowing people to take protective actions. Conclusion Building codes and earthquake resilience are ongoing endeavors in regions susceptible to seismic activity. By learning from past events and adopting stricter regulations, these areas are better prepared to withstand earthquakes and minimize the associated risks. Retrofitting, public awareness, and innovative technologies are essential components of these efforts. The future promises more robust building codes, improved construction practices, and enhanced earthquake prediction and warning systems, ultimately making communities in earthquake-prone regions safer and more resilient. Building codes, coupled with proactive measures and the engagement of local communities, serve as the foundation for a more earthquake-resistant future. Please feel free to like, share and comment.